Okay, so the other thing I'm going to cover today is uh, non-federal real estate renders, NPR. So here's a couple of examples, and then we'll we'll get into MicroStation here in just a second. All right. Now for the good part. Okay, so um, I've got MicroStation already loaded here, and here's the visualization um, ribbon. And here's the render scene icon, which opens the view rendering dialog, which is this guy right here. Right. And if I look, my history appears here. So I can go to these different renders and see a history. Now, if you want to render, a scene and you want to be able to perform relighting or NPR effects, you'll need to enable these guys right here prior to rendering. Also, if you look up at the top, this is, if you click here, these are your tone mappers. So you have all these different tone map options. If you want to save an image, the floppy icon everyone recognizes, right? Also, there's a little arrow on the right-hand side of the dialog. And you can expand or collapse to see the post-render options. And if you wanted to have NPR effects. So if I had this scene and I wanted to give NPR a spin, then I can say apply. And it'll go out and start processing right away with this one called default. Okay, so I don't know why default had a thickness of 80, which is obviously going to look pretty bad. Let's set the two. And I'm going to change the color as well. All right, so let's make this black. Okay, so the other thing that you can do, so I, I chose default, but now I can come down here and change the process shader or the outline. So instead of using whatever it happens to be that was built into that one, I could change it to say India Ink. Now, the other thing that I sometimes will do, and I, we're gonna make some changes here because I'm gonna turn this off. And the reason I'm gonna turn it off is because every little click I make could trigger yet another process. So let's go and change this to India Ink and see the thickness was gonna B6. So let's make this three and then apply it. Okay. So then I could say, well, instead of using the shader, whatever this one is, let's try using painting two. All right, and now my line weight is a little too much, so let's set this to two. Okay. So that is NPR in that particular scene. So let's go look at some more of these that I've done. In fact, we can go back to that original file. Okay, so this is kind of a good one here. So. Let's see whether or not this is working. Did Paul Chater ever show up? I don't see him in the list. Okay. So this scene, I wanted to do some post-processing on because if I turn off the post-processing, it looks okay, but I wanted to make it 
maybe desaturated a little bit, a little more light. So I went in and made some adjustments. So I adjusted the saturation and I also changed the gamma on this one. So every time that you guys do a render, you will have th these options. You will not see NPR effects or relighting unless you enable them prior to the render, okay? If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.